I'm uh, Stephen Weisbord. I'm a uh, nephrologist at the VA Pittsburgh Healthcare System and at the University of Pittsburgh, and I'm the principal investigator of the uh, PRESERVE trial, the prevention of serious adverse events following angiography trial. The trial was sponsored by the VA Cooperative Studies Program and by the uh, George Institute for Global Health in Australia. PRESERVE was a clinical trial uh, conducted at 53 sites. And the design of the trial, the specific aims of it were to assess the uh, efficacy of sodium bicarbonate infusion compared to sodium chloride infusion and the efficacy of N-acetylcysteine for the prevention of adverse outcomes and acute kidney injury following coronary and non-coronary angiography. As I mentioned, the study was conducted at 53 sites. It was a two by two factorial design, so all patients received two different interventions either uh, sodium bicarbonate or sodium chloride, and either N-acetylcysteine or placebo. The primary endpoint of the study was a composite of death, need for dialysis, or a 50% increase in serum creatinine at 90 days following angiography, and contrast-associated acute kidney injury was a secondary outcome. We enrolled 5,177 patients, at which point the study was stopped based on conditional power analyses that demonstrated a very low likelihood of finding a statistically significant benefit with either intervention. 4,993 patients were included in the modified intent to treat analysis. The primary findings of the study were that sodium bicarbonate was not superior to sodium chloride for the prevention of either our primary outcome, again, death, need for dialysis, or persistent increase in serum creatinine in 90 days, and that N-acetylcysteine was not superior to placebo for the prevention of uh, that primary outcome. With regard to our secondary outcomes, the main secondary outcome was contrast-associated acute kidney injury, and neither sodium bicarbonate nor N-acetylcysteine was effective for the prevention of acute kidney injury. So we believe that the PRESERVE trial will be a uh, definitive study with regard to the uh, efficacy of these two interventions that have been used widely in clinical practice despite a relative absence of data to strongly support their use. And we think that the findings will impact the care being, uh, being provided to millions of patients both in the United States and worldwide who have underlying chronic kidney disease and are undergoing angiograms and are at risk for these adverse outcomes. Thank you.